Hello everyone. This video will discuss how to install Half-Life 2 mods onto your PC. First, download the mod. In this example, I will be installing the Half-Life 2 Episode 3 mod from the ModDB website. There can also be other websites that host Half-Life 2 mods, not just ModDB website. You might also need Half-Life Episodes 1 and 2. The reason is because some mods use assets from these expansions. If you don't have them yet, you can buy them on Steam, especially when they are on discount during Steam sales. Then, download and install Source SDK 2013 single player from your Steam library. This is the current version of the program. Older versions such as 2006 and 2007 exist, but generally you want to use the latest version unless the mod specifically says to use it. After installing Source SDK, right-click on it. Go to Properties, Betas, set to Upcoming and then close the window to apply the changes. After this, go to your Steam directory, Steam Apps, Source Mods folder and this is one of the most important steps so please listen carefully. All mods should be placed here inside a named folder. The name of the folder must be exact as what the mod needs it to be. Hence you need to consult the mod that you downloaded. For example, if the mod comes already with a named folder with all of the mod files in it when you open the downloaded .zip or .rar file, you simply extract the folder here and you can move on to the next step. However, if the mod does not come with a named folder, you have to create a folder first and then name the folder according to what the mod needs the name to be. For example, to install Half-Life 2 Episode 3 mod, I make a new folder and name it as shown on screen. This exact name as shown on screen is according to what the mod needs it to be. I figured this out while searching in the Steam discussions. I then open the folder and extract all of the files from the archive to that folder. This goes for every Half-Life 2 mod that you put in here. You need to name the folder according to what the mod needs the name to be. Otherwise if you just drag mod files into this directory or if you name the folder in any other name then your Steam library will not be able to read the mod. Hence consult the mod manual if you don't know what to name the folder. After this, restart Steam by exiting it and then running it again. The game should then appear in your Steam library. Click on play to play the mod. If this has helped you, consider liking and subscribing. Happy modding and gaming.